This person said, did I hear you mention Medicare will pay for the cost exceeding the patient's monthly income, meaning income is lost, but assets are protected. So let me clarify a couple of things. We're talking about Medicaid, not Medicare, but that's totally fine. Everybody screws that up, including me, uh, before I started doing this for a living. So Medicare is health insurance for everyone in this country over 65, as long as you worked enough quarters. And Medicaid is for, at least their long-term care program that we work on is for technically indigent folks that need long-term care, such as in-home care, assisted living, memory care, skilled nursing. So you did hear me correctly in that in Florida, we are the best state in the country if you happen to get old and sick and need care. And we have lots of strategies that allow our seniors to get Medicaid long-term care benefits without that dreaded Medicaid spend down, which requires you to spend down all of your countable assets to below $2,000 before Medicaid would kick in. And many of our strategies are available to those folks within the five-year look-back period. So meaning our strategies are not subject to the Medicaid five-year analysis. And so doing these things on the eve of applying for Medicaid does not cause a penalty, whereas uh, many strategies do cause the penalty and many states don't authorize the strategies that Florida allows that are not subject to the Medicaid five-year analysis. And in a nursing home scenario, Medicaid will pay the entire nursing home bill over your income. So you have to give up your income minus $130 that you get to keep for what's called uh, patient needs or um, yeah, patient needs. I don't know, I'm having a senior moment. Anyway, I digress. So you pay for uh, everything above your income with Medicaid. So if you make $1,000 a month, you get to to uh, keep $130 a month for your personal needs, then you would pay $870 a month to your nursing home out of your 1,000. You keep the other 30, that's where we get to your 1,000. And then Medicaid pays the difference between that 870 a month that you are paying as your patient responsibility and you know 10 to $20,000 retail price tag for Medicaid nursing home here in Florida. So that's a huge help, and you don't need to be a resident of Florida for any length of time. As long as you are in the state of Florida when you apply for Medicaid and getting care in Florida, we treat you as if you're a Florida resident. So you don't need to be here for six months or a year before going through the Medicaid application process. Hopes this helps. Have a great day. Great day.